Hey guys, I got a pretty big Timu haul. I got 17 canvases and I had to, and I just stuffed them in there because I didn't show them to anybody yet. I don't feel comfortable sitting down doing this. I'm better off standing and kind of like bouncing back from foot to foot thing and like that's kind of what I do best and I like it better that way but these aren't big canvases so I thought I'd try just sitting down like I used to in a very uncomfortable way and then it, I'm in I'm in perfection you know I see the imperfections and I, I want to do that and I don't want to do that on camera I fix them later, you know. I have a really nice time when I do it, too. I fix them all at one time, like one after the other, and, you know, after they're already shown. And, I don't know. I guess other people would enjoy that process, too. But I just don't do it. Because I, I'm learning, okay. I'm not an, a diamond painting expert. And... I'm constantly evolving through this process, like constantly realizing, you know what, what, something I thought was very important in the beginning is not important at all now. It's like, that don't even matter now. We have moved on. It's all kinds of little things. So um, the best way to to get this flat, this plastic flat, and get the canvases to lay flat, is to pull the plastic back halfway and use this to smooth it out. And that way you don't have to use your hand, because I was using my hand, and then I was using a roller, I was using my bone knife, you know, but once I tried this, and this is supposed to be for straightening your lines all the way across, right? So I, ne I never thought about using it on the canvas like that. It just didn't occur to me. And um, it's like the hundredth monkey effect, or monkey see, monkey do, more like it. Uh, but anyways, yeah, so I do that now, and I think like that, that has been the best way to do it so far. So like, you know, you're, you're glad when you learn these little things. So uh, anyhow, yeah, I don't really like to do all that on camera. Maybe I should. So this this canvas has 26 colors. It's not my typical style, but yet it is. You know, like, it's colorful, it's impish, and it's freaky. And uh, I like it. You can see all the colors nice and clear. Like every square. What you see is what you get. They're round colors. Whoops, I have it down here. There's a lot of glare in here. Okay, but um, it looks like a nice build. It doesn't look like there's too much of anything I can't handle. And it looks like it's going to turn out nice. Yeah, each each square is going to be a dot. I mean, I love it when they come like this, pixelated like this. Some people don't like it. I le I want to see it like that. There's a fine fine definition in in the lines, like you know what I mean, the R and the E. Like you could see that it's like perfect. And some canvases, the colors just all blur together, and they're not well defined at all. So this is a good canvas. Uh, I'm taking note of the companies that the canvases turn out good and the canvases that don't turn out good. There's another one of him. Let me find it. Hold up. I'm digging through all of this. Okay. I found it. But I also found this in there. There's no way. There's no way I want my money back for this. This is like a 40 by 50. I'm not I'm doing that. I'm taking a picture of that and I'm saying you can forget it. I'll send it back to you if you need it. I want my money back. If they tell me to keep it, maybe I'll try to work on it and fix it. I don't know. 
I don't know. But just seeing it like this, I'm like, you're kidding me? I'm not paying for that. You're going to buy it like that in a store? Maybe in a dollar bin, right? Like, maybe. I'm, I'm not dealing with that. I, t I take enough from the shipping in the bags. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, is it better to get some messed up products or to pay shipping? I think I'd rather pay the shipping and have it come in a box and nothing be smashed. But the quality of the products that come from Timu aren't exactly all that great anyway. So you don't expect much. You know, I mean, yeah, you find some good can canvases. Uh, they're nice. But the shipping just ruined this one. So even if it is a nice painting, I don't care. Like, that just ruined it for me. I don't want that. I wouldn't buy that. So I want my money back for that. And now it's going to be a pain to own that and to think you've got that canvas and you're not working on it. It's like, well... And that's what happens when you find things that have imperfections in it. You know, that the canvases will sit and you're you're like, oh, yeah, why am I working on that one? And it's like, well, you got so many, you can't work on them all anyway. It's like, but I'm not ever going to work on that. It's never going to be my choice. You know? And that kind of blows. Okay, so let me get this one over here. And uh, if if the tape goes off, if the, it's not tape, it's digital. Okay, so if the recording goes off, I'll just... It already did. No, it didn't. It's on. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Yeah, that's that flower vase that I got. Okay, because here's number two. And there's probably more of them. I don't know. They both come with squishies and um, a big, a big piece baggies, and three places. So that's pretty good too. So I think I like this company and the way they're doing things. And I don't have any reason to suspect that this is not going to turn out and look like what it's supposed to turn out. You know what? Hold up and let me get the name of this company for you. Okay. These were three dollars and fifty nine cents. It says four forty nine now. Ten bags. Okay, advertise everything I get. And it's the here's uh gimme. Gimli. Gimli. And they got a lot of really colorful stuff there. Well, that's just the top. But. Did I follow them? I should, I gotta do that. Yeah, I'm following them. Okay, so there was that one. Yeah, and this one is four forty nine now. It's three fifty nine, and it'll probably go on sale and get marked down, and you get your money back. Cause it's not how it happened with me. Like I got it at the sale price, but I usually you get the sale price. Now that's a different company. <gasps> get out of here. This one is Lee Kala. Oh, it's cats. Look at all those cats. Ch -ch -ch, meow, meow, meow. Oh my gosh. Yes. Ch -ch -ch, meow, meow, meow. I never thought to do it like that. I was always... Ch -ch -ch. <gasps> I like that one. Oh, they got an astronaut kitty, but that's like... A dream, yeah, it is a dream. Oh, okay, I'm getting out of there. So I like that company. All right. I take. I'm just taking away too much time. Twenty-five colors in this one. You can see his purple right off the get-go, but. That's what I got it for. I like the purple and blue. Like, I just like the colors all together. And he's impish. He's creepy, creepy. Okay, 
so then let's see since I'm talking about cats I'm going to try to do two in the next five minutes <laughs> I, I don't care for the sun symbolism, like the halo, it's Christ symbolism, the mockery all the time. The same way, I don't, I'm, I just turn the tablet on, hold up. The yeah, same as the second painting company, the Kala, and he says four ninety nine. Is that that's not what I paid for him, I know that. I paid $3.99. Okay, let me go back to him. And so, I don't know. There's something very similar about those two companies. So they must be related in some way. Yeah. Look, it's the same things on top. They're related in some way. And... If you look at this, it's not how I thought it was going to come. Okay, now look at the, the look at this image. We'll get him big again. Okay. I don't know what I thought, but when I got the canvas, it just looks better than I thought. Like his face ain't all that great to begin with, and I knew that. So like, on one hand, I wasn't going to get him. I didn't like it. But it's a cat with a knife. I mean, I love cats with knives. And it's Michael Meowers. <laughs> so, I, I, you know, there's things I don't like about this type of stuff. And the, the image. But then, you know, there's only so much you could do be, before, you know, you accept that negative stuff in. Like, this, this, I could do it in a cartoony way. You know, I, I can't do darkness very good just as it is, you know. So his colors got that sun. You can see where the sun's going to be here. That's the only thing with color, uh, the red and the oranges. So there's three different colors for the sun. And then everything is just his clothes and uh, pumpkins and sky, which is his clothes are the same color. The sky. All right, and I got one more. And after I show you this, if there's still more time, I'm just gonna crease it out. That's what I'll do for the rest of the video. I'll say whatever. That's well. That's plans. Things don't usually go as planned. All right. So this is another kind of darker image. It's the first wolf I ever seen that I thought looked good. So you know here's just regular different company. And it's the first wolf I thought really looked good. I thought he did. It's just really good. So I got him. And it's only 30 by 30. Let me get back and Let's see what the heck I'm doing on here. I paid three fourteen. It's three forty nine now. Create it space. It comes from create it space. I don't know. I don't know about this one. Let's, let me get a look here. Well, you can see her eyeballs, and his eyeballs. <laughs> um, R, D, W, N. That's what's in the, the black. R, D, W, N. The G's and the O's are looking almost identical. But you can see the difference. And I got this because my magnifying eyeglasses and light pad just aren't enough for some things that I, I actually have to use the magnifying glass too. But it looked okay when I reviewed it on here. Looks exactly the same. It's like what you see is what you get with them. Creative space is that one. Okay. So... Now, 
So I did that. Here's the colors. Well, it's just what you see, what you get. Kind of deal with this stuff. I, I mean. This is just the best way to do it. You know, you live and you learn. And I was glad when I learned this because I was doing it with my hand. I was doing it with the roller. I was doing it with like everything. Bone, the, the bone, what's it called? The bone knife. I was using the bone knife. laying flatter already. And I did the first one before. That's what I'm putting in this video, I think. Do I have one more darker one? This, I mean, this cat, though, I mean, he really looks, it looks good. The canvas looks good. And this border up here, go all the way around. I want to open these all at some point today and I guess I'll just do a little bit, upload a video, do a little bit. I also got the one for my giveaway in here. I got a six pack. I'm just, I can't open them all right now, but I have to. I have to find out what's messed up. If anything's messed up, because if, if I want to return any any of the other ones, and I just do this one first, then I might I might not be able to do it. But I don't think any of them are gonna it'd be so bad that I'd want to return them. I think this is it. This is a kicker. I never received anything like this. This might as well be garbage. I don't know. I don't know. But see, it's conf I'm confused when it comes to things like these, so I need time to think about what I'm going to do. Like, if, am I overreacting? You know, I didn't open it up and uh, take pictures and, you know, see, is this going to be okay? I haven't done that yet. And I will, before I, I'll do that before I tell them, but I'm going to take the picture of it like this. and I'm kind of wanting to do it now. But I'm not. I'm going to go get a shower after I review. And then let my phone charge up to where it doesn't have to be plugged in. It's plugged in now, and I can't stand it. And, um, and then I'll have one that's got a lot more canvases in it. You know. Because there's going to... Oh my God! There's gonna be like uh, like 40 canvases before I'm done with all of this, and uh, I don't know what I'm doing. Like I see these things that I like and that I want, and I just buy it. And it was really, if don't you eat my chair? If you think about it, I feel like I've almost got my money's worth just just by ordering and having them and then by doing whatever canvas I feel like at the time like I, it it's kind of rewarding just to just to get them just to get the canvases and be like like this 
You know what I mean? It's like, it's just nice to look at. Well, not that these ones are pretty. Well, they're kind of pretty. But, I mean, they're evil lamps. What, what are you going to do? They're colorful. And, you know, uh, for evil stuff, you know, they're kind of cute. I don't know. I liked it. If I'm going to go demony, it's got to be cartoony. Right? So, I get the, I get these canvases I like, and it pleases me so much to flip through and, and see my choices. And then I see the ones, well, maybe I don't need that one. You know? And anyway, oh, I'm going to do a giveaway. I'm not waiting for the channel to climb in subscribers, but that's the, the rule, is you have to be a subscriber. And I think I'm going to, like, kind of give whoever the winner is, I'm going to like, give them their choice out of so many paintings. Like, pick one of these, or I'm just going to send you whatever and not one of these. And they'll have that option. And they'll be good ones. I'm, you know, whatever you get is going to be a good one. But, you know, it's, it helps to know if you, if, you know, what kind of stuff you like. Anyhow, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna wrap this up and uh, I'm gonna go get my shower that I should have got last night. Peace out and God bless.